Hello Zebrahead, welcome back to Plan for the Zombies Battle for Neighborville. Today, we are taking a look at our first set of challenges for Feast of Us. This time around, it is going to be Electric Slide. Character challenges and rewards are only available until the end of the current prize map, of course, and for doing them all, we get the Feast of Us party hat. So let's start with Electric Slide right here, our first challenge of Feast of Us, and see how it goes. So our first one is Stun Your Foes with Boogie Bolt. That is, of course, the thing that makes them fly all over the place, so that shouldn't be too tough. It has a pretty big range. Deal damage with Disco Tornado will actually be a lot of fun. That's my, one of my favorite moves in this game. Push enemies with the Funky Bouncer. Actually, maybe I'm getting this m messed up. You can stun your foes with Boogie Bolt? Hold on. Yeah, what is Boogie Bolt, then? Oh, maybe I'm getting this mixed up. The primary weapon is Boogie Bolt. I didn't realize it has a chance to stun enemies. That's new then. Okay, I think. Maybe I'm wrong. <laughs> Maybe I'm just being really silly. Earn experience with Electric Slide and then get chained hits with primary. So basically, stun your foes with Boogie Bolt and get chained hits with primary are gonna sort of tie together as we use that primary weapon. But that's gonna be a lot of fun. Honestly, not too daunting set of challenges. It might take some extra time, but we should be able to get to it no problem. So let's head into some turf takeover and have some fun. Okay, so we're joining the zombie team. It looks like we're already on the attack. So let's just try to help out our teammates a little bit. We got a decently sized team, so things should work out pretty well. So let's go ahead and track some stuff. Uh, I think the one that I mostly wanna focus on for right now is push enemies with the funky bouncer because that seems pretty simple and I'll just be able to keep a good tab on it. But as soon as the Funky Bounce is available, I'm just gonna toss it out and see who we can bounce around. Like, that just sounds like fun to me. Uh, I'll just have to work on my aim. I know that my aim with Electric Slide isn't the best at the moment. Oh gosh, it really is not the best. Throw this out quickly, quickly. There's one, plenty to go. Oh, I can't even see. No, I'm not turning into a goat. Oh, they got me, that was their trap. They knew I'd run away and then they just attacked me. There has been so many Rose players recently. I think that Rose had some positive changes going on, which is awesome, I love the Rose. But because of that, there has been so many Rose players just constantly being turned into a goat. It was about to happen again. Who's behind me? Can you stop? Please. Okay, come on. Well, it looks like, ow. Oh, okay, somebody got you. I'm gonna get you. It isn't gonna happen right now, I hope you know. Boom, there it is, there it is. I didn't get you all the way, but it did some damage on you. I might actually have to turn on aim assist again for uh, electric slide. I just don't know if I can handle it without. It is not good enough with her yet. Okay, so who's out this way? Especially with a lower fire rate now, I just, gives me less of a chance to land up my shots, of course. And that'll change over time, like I said, if I can just get some more practice with her. But anyways, there is the electrical station captured. We're joining into this round late, but that doesn't mean we can't contribute. So yeah, let's go this way. But yeah, definitely, I don't think these challenges are too bad. They might be a bit time consuming for some of them, for sure, definitely this one. I think this one would be so much easier in like, wait, did I? I'm here early. Well, look at me being punctual. Hey, you get back here. Wait, 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 hold on. No, too close, too close. I pressed the wrong button. There we go. Gotcha. See, I don't know how to stun per a person with this primary weapon. Maybe you just have to hit them multiple times. Maybe it's just like a chance-based thing. I hadn't realized that was even a thing. But now that I think about it, I feel like there have been a couple times I've been attacked by an electric slide and I'll stop for a second. Okay, yeah, you get back. No goat, no goat. Okay, you ready for this? Do that, <laughs> that did not land the way I wanted it to. They all just sort of dodged it. But now they're starting to get bunched up, which means we will have, sooner or later, a perfect opportunity to throw that out and it'll do a lot of damage. Right now though, that actually, we were able to push three enemies with that funky bouncer, so we're up to four. Doesn't seem like much, but that'll stack out. And if we were to go into story mode, you could run up to a group of plants and just throw that out and build it up real quick. So definitely, that's something I suggest. As per usual, going into the story mode is probably one of the easiest ways to complete most of the challenges in, in the game that we end up getting. Okay, can I get you or no? You're gonna give me a hard time. There we go, there we go. That was probably not worth doing, but it's what I did. Okay, here we go. Did I get you? Oh my gosh! You know, I was him last episode, so you know what? I, I can't be too upset by that. I'd be super happy if I was him right now. Yeah, that got a one more? I thought that at least got the rose and the uh, sunflower there, but I guess not. 
See, it might take me some time to warm up a little bit, but we'll get through it. So definitely with Funky Bouncer though, it's just about finding those groups. That's really how you should play Electric Slide anyways, is wait for those groups to build up because that's what she sort of thrives on with her primary weapon bouncing between them, with her moves having an area of effect. She's really good at taking out groups of plants and you just sort of have to play to that strength as much as you can for these challenges and you should be good. Um, okay, let's get down this way. Of course, groups of plants aren't gonna be as big as they used to anymore with there being only eight people in turf takeover instead of 12. Still on the fence about that change because of things like that, but at the end of the day, the rounds have been fun the last couple of episodes, so I can't complain too much, can I? Um, let's throw that out there. Do this so we can do, oh no, wrong thing. Uh, do as much damage as we can. Will it take him out though? It will, that's great. Who's over here I can't even see right now? There's just too much going on. Oh, oh, getcha, gotcha, please. Ah, got you a little bit. Okay, be gone. See ya. Oh, I got you. Cool. So up to nine out of 50. Yeah, if we could get like halfway, I mean, I don't think we'll be able to do that because this is a partial round, but let's just try to get as close as we can to halfway. That'd be cool. Okay, ready? Get that out there. That hit and no one. Okay, you should probably be chasing me. You're not. Oh, but there's the Citron. We'll get the Citron. It will get the Citron. We're up to 10. We are up to 10. So I'm just gonna keep attacking you until that, like maybe you will get stunned. Gotcha. Let's revive you. Like this can't be charged up or anything, no. So we should be fine. So let me see, I wanted to see if that made any progress. So I have stunned some people, just without even knowing it. That's another one where in story mode, you can just sort of run around and attack a bunch of people with your primary weapon over and over again. Or a lot of you have suggested solo ops, garden ops, graveyard ops. Those are also great game modes to complete some challenges because there's just a huge influx of enemies. So all those definitely worth considering. Oh, hi. Uh, can you guys go away? Okay, I didn't realize that it'll grab a rose even if she's in her, uh, her floating mode. Oh no. Okay, well I wasn't able to vanquish her, but that's fine. I don't know if I want to grab a bomb just yet. I'd rather work on just vanquishing people. As per usual, right? Ow, ooh, not good. Oh, again with the sap trap. It's getting me all sticky. Okay, well, well, I'm being revived. Thank you very much, scientist. Thank you. Uh, Couldn't quite get them there. That's that's all right. Oh no, <laughs> the giant goat is coming to get me. I can't let you do it to me. Are there any plants over there? I guess not. I do see a nightcap way down there. Uh, We'll try to get you a little bit. If I could get that, once again, the electric jam and sort of bouncing around, that'd be cool. Come on, I got one of you. That's nice. Who can I help over this way? Because we got 14 out of 50. Like, you know, if this was a full round, we could definitely have gotten up to 25, I feel. Okay, they don't seem to have seen me. So, you know, we're going all the, ow, every time with the marshmallows. Okay, gotcha. I can't seem to get you. It was Space Cadet was sort of in the way. That's fine, she's just trying to help. Ow, stop please. Oh, you know what? She thinks I'm gonna go around. Time for Operation Sneaky Pants. Oh no, he's figured me out. No way, he's a one hit, one hit, one hit, one hit. Bah, bah, bah. Okay, somebody got him. Wait, do I still have the bomb? I do. I always get worried about that. Come on, keep going. I can taste it. No way, I taste pain. Okay, Engineer can get it though. Go get it, Engineer. You can do it. This is why it's important for your teammates to hang out with you when you have the bomb, because you can be ever so close, and then somebody will take you out. Oh my gosh, will they be able to get it? It's right there, right? Oh no, there's two of them right on top of each other. That is such a shame. Come on, we gotta help our team. Let's spawn in some friends too. The more we can overwhelm the plants, the better. But still, not a single bomb delivered, which is not good. There is an oak somewhere around here. It's over there. So still, it looks like neither of those made their mark. That is such a shame. Throwing this that way, ow, okay. Move it. Oh, I didn't even see you before. Oh, I'm gonna get you. No, I never mind. Somebody else got you. It was the outhouse zombie. That's sort of funny. So who's around here that we might be able to annoy? You guys. At least it a little bit. At least it a little bit. Let's totally disrupt this. Look at this. The whole party. The whole gang. They don't even know what's happening. Oh, it's great. It's total havoc. 
That's exactly what we want to do as a space cadet. It's just like totally disrupt them in that way. Um, okay, but then they're just totally going to blast me to smithereens. That was fine, that was worth it. If that buys us a couple extra seconds to deliver the bomb, then that's better. I say that, but we still haven't delivered a single bomb, so who knows what's actually happening here. Let's get that there. And that bomb's about to disappear. I'm trying so much to help support my team, but plants just make that so difficult. If only they would just surrender and let us win. There we go, there's a prize bulb. Awesome. Oh, here we go, here we go. That was definitely some good electrical bounce damage. Ow, oh, stop that. You know what? We're getting a little closer. A little closer to the action would maybe be good for us. I don't know if that actually really did anything worthwhile, but I at least tried. Did we even throw this? We didn't. Oh, come on, no, not again! Back to back, goats! This is not cool. Okay, let's help you out. Oh, can I get the space cadet? Get you revived, who's behind me? Can you guys stop with this for like five seconds? Oh my gosh, they are on a mission right now. On a mission. Destroy everything zombie related. They're doing a very good job. Apparently at some point the team delivered a bomb. I'm going to try to deliver one as well. I picked the bomb up, at least it gives me some experience. But we have less than a minute to deliver five bombs. I'm a little bit hesitant to say that that's gonna work out. Ow, ooh. I don't know where that was even coming from. But maybe I could just fly under their radar with all the other zombies trying to do whatever they're doing, whatever they normally do. Okay, this guy doesn't see me. Get some damage on him. That's fun. But well, let's get you a little bit. Okay, get rid of these plant pots. Obviously, it doesn't do too much, but it's something. Okay. Oh, yeah, I'm done for. I am done for. I'm, I'm slowed down and everything. Yeah, it's just, this is definitely, this was already a tough round to win as the zombies. I've talked about that at nauseum, but I feel like it's tougher with an even smaller team. I know that the balancing is that the plants have a smaller team too, but they were already at an advantage for this game mode. So, or at least for this point specifically. So yeah, one bomb delivered is all we're gonna get, but I could maybe get some more damage with the primary weapon. No, yeah, I tried. Okay, uh, yeah, that's gonna be it. Oh well, that was still a pretty good round overall, seeing how I joined late, we got a good chunk of things done. We'll continue proceeding with the challenges in the next round. So here is another round. Let's go for it. Haven't played this area in today's episode, so this should be pretty good. I really do hope they add more turf takeover maps sooner or later. Of course, we checked out the new map, Uzavar, but that was not a turf takeover one. It would make me so happy if they eventually do turn that into one, but I have no clue if they end up planning on it. Okay, well, is there any plants around? Because if not, I'm gonna take advantage. Yeah, there just really isn't anybody, so let's stay together. <laughs> okay, this is great. I just get to chill out, capture the point. They have a tiny team, they don't. They just have other priorities, I suppose. There was a pea shooter there. Where are they? It's getting a little lonely. I need somebody to fight. All right, well. Yes, I was, I was invited with this guy. Ah, oh, hey! Now let's get a bit more crowded. No, you don't, sorry. A little too late. I find it funny that I complained about nobody being here, and then as soon as somebody shows up, I'd knock him out. All right, well, that's fine. We got the first round, like, that was that was super nice. The first point, already captured. Gotta go to Ono Taco now. And it was basically all me. All right, well, that's a bit of a confidence booster. No celebration until we're done. Capture the Uno Taco for my next booster. I'm trying. So we got over this way? There was a nightcap running around. Couldn't quite keep up with it though. Let's spawn in some friends. Got that there. This could certainly help for this point. This point could be a tad bit more of a challenge. But yeah, I think that if we could, if the round doesn't go that quickly every time, we could definitely get this push enemies with the Funky Bouncer mostly complete this time. I mean, it's what I'm mostly focused on anyways. But where are the plants? Okay, hi guys. Now the problem with this is that it's not what I was looking for in terms of, there we go. Oh boy, ow, the double logs. Two overlords is too many. We of course showed case this costume last episode, but man, I was a little crazy. Let's try again. 
they're gonna put up quite the fight. But if I could get a good thunderstorm on them, that would be amazing. That would really stack up the damage for that. And it looks like it counted, even though like it doesn't actually move them around. I'm still up 23 out of 50, so it went up two. Oh, that was a nightcap right there. Okay, be careful about that. Come on, no you don't, no you don't. I can sorta of kinda of see your little footsteps, but I couldn't get you. Darn. Okay, I see you over there. What do you think you're doing, hmm? Okay, I need to get over there. What is with that? Go, he's going to the moon. Okay, throw this over that way. Throw this like that, and then go into the energy mode. Here we go. Oh no, you don't. Okay, yes you do. This definitely feels like a set of challenges that would be very, very doable in a single player setting now. A lot of these are just take out lots of enemies with specific moves, which there are usually enemies just waiting around to be taken out with specific moves in story mode, of course. So definitely I think that's where, if we don't get everything done today, that's where I'm mostly gonna focus things. But with this, you know, bouncy grenade, bou funky bouncer, that's what it's called, uh, it's mostly just, you know, waiting for everybody to be grouped up and then maybe trying to get them in a corner. That's what, what realistically you wanna do is try to get them bunched up into a corner so that you can end up, oh no. Uh, okay, I just wanna hide for now. <laughs> Here we go. So that you can hit them with the thunderstorm. I keep on thinking the thunderstorm is triangle when it clearly isn't. I don't know why that is, why that's something I'm messing up with, but it is. But yeah, this has been, it's been okay. I feel like our team is doing well, but I, I could be doing better in terms of actually getting vanquishes and stuff. I only have one, so yeah. Not doing the best there. But our team is doing great when it comes to pushing the point and stuff. Just gotta keep contributing. Keep getting more stuff figured out. I mean, I know there's at least a plant right over this way. And then, yeah, that's not really gonna get to him. That was sort of not worth it. Ah, watch it. Be very careful here. If I could just stall out for as long as I can. Ah, nope, not happening. Now the plant team is starting to put up a bit more of a fight, so maybe more people have joined. They're starting to group together more, which definitely doesn't make it easy for me. Yeah, we have, okay, wrong way. That's still an issue they need to fix. Um, but they're they're starting the, the fight back on this point. I saw a good chunk of them grouped up. We're not gripping up as well as they are either, so that definitely makes this tough. Okay, spawn in a zombie. We'll spawn in a bucket head for now. Where is this nightcap at? Because this nightcap is causing us a lot of a lot of trouble. I do not know. Okay, there's a pea shooter over this way. Actually, a whole group of enemies, so we're going to throw out the thundercloud and hope it hits somebody at least a tiny bit. Oh my gosh, my aim with that has been just not so good. There we go, I got the kernel corn back a little bit. Okay, who is it now? Who is it now? Okay, I got some stuns there. They have, do they have two acorns on top of them? They might. No, I, I think it's just one. Come on, come on, come on. That's actually working out really, really well. Okay, where do you think you're going? Uh, you, you got away, so wherever you thought you were going. It worked out. Okay, you know what? I'm gonna go a little bit up close and personal and hope that this group just like doesn't even realize what I'm doing. I'm gonna throw that over there, turn around. Uh, there's a pea shooter over this way. Can we get him? Can we get him? No, he's he's vanquished. Oh well. Ow, why does that have to happen? <laughs> but we're at 29 out of 50, like we're really getting closer. I'm working on it, that's for sure. Let's see how our other challenges are doing. Um, if we take a look here, I mean, honestly, yeah, I just, I think it's mostly because I'm not that creative an electric slide player, so I really wouldn't mind really quickly. Controls, is it in here, right? Uh, aim assist, PvP. Let's put it to light, because apparently they've changed how this works anyway, so maybe I can get a little bit of an improvement. If it doesn't work out, it doesn't work out. Most people have it on light, that's the default. A lot of people have it on light and they don't even realize. Let's spawn in some friends again. Get that here. A TV head down this way, okay. And what about this way? We'll get a little imp. So I'm just trying to get up to a good position where maybe we could cause some havoc, especially on like this guy way down here. That's actually working out great because that damage stacks up more and more. Apparently I am getting stuns. A lot of them, actually. There we go, character challenge, that must be for the stuns. That actually, that happened really quick. I don't know why, I guess just he's a good target for it. 
Okay, so now we're at a times two vanquish streak. Okay, you buddy, you gotta go. Oh wow, okay, two for one. <laughs> Didn't even try to do that, just sort of happened. Oh no, you don't. You, you get back here. Okay, well, yeah. almost got you. Hmm. Okay, this point we're storming through. Who's over this way? Uh, you are. I did it again. I don't know why I think every time that's the storm button. It clearly is not. Oh, no, 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 no. I didn't even mean to throw that out. It sort of worked that way. Where are you? Sorry, I can't let you do that. Can't let you get away with it. Level seven achieved. So now things are starting to pick up the pace a little bit. Maybe we got the experience thing. Yeah, that's what, no, that was get chain hits with primary. Oh, really? Okay. That wasn't even the stun one then. I probably shouldn't have checked out where I did. That was my fault. But hey, we're being revived. Teammates got my back. Thank you. Ah, so where are those plants at? We're gonna try to sneak around the side, see if we can't run into a couple of them. Probably not, but you never know. So we got our last point, and the good thing for this one is that the enemy should be a little bit more concentrated, you would imagine, if they're trying to defend this point. But I don't know. I feel like, yeah, like once we're on the defensive side, then they'll definitely be bunched up. You would imagine. Because they're all trying to stay in one, like, square to capture a point. So maybe that's when things will sort of skyrocket a little bit for us. I wonder if they're piecing together where I'm going. Oh, there's a Snapdragon way down that way. Oh, and they're landing the damage on me. Almost got him now. Whoa, where's he going? Did he get hit with an acorn or a walnut? I mean, I think he did. But I didn't get the vanquish for that. Ah! Darn it! Double darn it! Come on! <laughs> These walnuts keep getting me recently. Ah, man. Not good. Not good at all. Let's run back out there. Come on. Oh, you guys are all over the place. I can't see a thing. Space Cadets all up in my face. Okay, you ready for this? Because I am. Okay, that counted. 31 out of 50. Let's get that right over there. And then who's over here? Oh, you're, oh, come on. I was just about to throw out the storm. Would have been so good against him. I've had such a tough time with that specifically, is getting the storm out in good positions. Oh, well, we'll get there, we'll get there. Might not be all the way in today's episode, but I'll get as far as I possibly can. There we go. Run, run, run. But yeah, everything works so well in conjunction, like all together, with Space Cadet, all of her abilities and her primary weapon and thing. thing. So usually when you're getting one challenge done, you're also sort of kind of getting another one done. At least for the most part. Especially, you know, the two primary weapon challenges and then the two uh, bouncy, a uh, funky bouncer in the storm. They both sort of work together to uh, get you what you need. Okay, got you at least a little bit there. And where are these guys at? Let's get rid of this because, you know, can't fight back. Too scared. That didn't really go the way I wanted it to. Where are the plants at? I'm having a hard time finding some. Oh, oh, there's a sunflower. And that's it, wow, okay, that was really quick. I was not expecting it to be so fast. So yeah, two rounds so far, and we're making some decent progress. I mean, we've gotten one of the challenges done. And then the other one is more than halfway through, and we haven't even gotten the experience one yet, so that's gonna happen sooner or later. So I think by next round, we'll be more than halfway done with the challenges, which will be pretty good. But for right now, there's zombies reaching outside of the television. He wants a slice of that pizza. More like a slice of the brains. All right, well, on to the next round. Another round is beginning, I'm a little late. I'm almost there. This will definitely be good because we are defending and I think that might make a bit of a difference. I can only hope, especially for a point like this where they usually group up right over here. We could get some major things done. I'm really hoping for it. Um, but they will need a couple of moments, of course, to get out that way. So my goal here is to very sneakily, very sneakily indeed, go around. Ow, oh, they found me. Oh, they most certainly did and I didn't get them with that, darn, okay. Come on, ready for this? No, come on, why did they just randomly have the intuition to turn around there for no reason? For no reason, like, oh, what's over here? Why? That could have been so good, there were three, there was, it was this oak and two acorns, it was three people could have earned up so much damage. There's a little bit of luck, or at least being better at electric slide than I am, that you're going to have to take advantage of if you want to get these challenges done online. 
but I'll get there. Sooner or later, I'll get there. Okay, so I don't see too much going on just yet. Oh, there's a rose over this way. And of course, this vase weed, of course. Don't know how I didn't notice you. Gotcha. So I think it only stuns if it's all grouped up because I haven't been getting the sun experience anymore. Where are they? And they have a decently sized team. Let's just throw you back. At the least we can do that. Oh, here you are, now you're in trouble. Why did it, why? I have questions that need to be answered. I pressed the button twice, it just kept going. <sighs> I'm gonna get you at some point. It's gonna earn up a lot of damage for me. Why am I facing this way? Another answer that I need desperately. Oh, you know what, I need to customize the electric slide. I try to customize the characters a bit more uh, sporadically when I'm doing these character challenge episodes. I need to do that for this one. So we'll do that after I get Vanquish, if I can remember. So like, you right here, you are what I wanna go for. I don't know if that's gonna work out. I'm sort of glad that they're healing up though, because then I can take advantage of that and just like keep attacking for longer. Okay, are you gonna turn around on me? Not if I have anything to say about it. No, no, where are you? I can't see a darn thing, there's plants in the way. <laughs> there's vines, little vines on the, on the rock. Ugh, not a good round so far. But at the same time, they haven't captured any of the points, so that's what really matters in terms of winning. How are we doing with experience for, no, wrong button, um, electric slide. We're very close, 400 experience to go. Well then we could definitely do that. So let's hop back over. Oh, definitely beat up this pea shooter before he has a chance to do much, and he had plenty of chances to do plenty. They're, they're good compared to me right now. Electric Slide is definitely one of my weaker zombies at the moment. I feel like there's been times where I've fluctuated doing good or bad with her. It's, it's just weird. It, it's tough for me to keep up with. It's hard for me to do consistently well with her, is the thing. And I think just a lot more time is what'll sort of settle that. Definitely need to take a, ah, another look at her abilities and uh, her upgrades, for sure. Okay, so let's run this over this way. Please, please hit somebody, something, anything. Oh my gosh. Because I'm too weak to really get up close and personal and hit them with the move. But if I do it from too far away, it's very hard to line up. Okay, well that was just me not doing a very stellar job. Oh my gosh, there's so many people over there. So many people, I need to take this opportunity. If I run down like this and then throw that down, they're, they're not here anymore. <laughs> Yeah, they didn't really get anything. Oh well, I tried, I tried. Oh no, you, okay, that, that was an engineer. Well that was a waste. I thought there was a chomper behind me. There was not. Okay, let's run. I definitely need some heals. Can we set up a Dr. Heals here? Because I don't think we have a scientist on our team right now, unfortunately. Hmm. Come on, most of the way there. And got it. Okay, who's over this way? Snapdragon. And there's an oak over this way as well. They're really trying to get us right now. But you know what, throw this back. Throw this over, please. Oh man, timing not quite what I wanted. It did do some damage though. That's, that's good. We're 38 out of 50 for our Funky Bouncer. That's not too bad. I seem to keep throwing it out. That's a pretty low cooldown, I mean, after all. Okay, definitely take advantage of all these little guys. Yeah, just like that. That got three of them. That's good. What are we at now? Should we be at 41? We'll find out. Come on. 41. If we can do that three more times, we've got that done. So that would be really great. Okay. Uh, not gonna be able to do much from that angle. But from over here, I can't see a darn thing. There's like so many visual effects for each move. It can be really hard to see just like what in the world is actually happening. Wow, was that another sap trap? I got two more people there at the least. It sends them back, which can be useful. All right, well they're definitely doing a good job against this, which happens. I mean, it's not really even too much of my concern. Mostly I'm just focused on getting these challenges done. Whoa, I'm up on the tree. I forgot you could do that. So where are they gonna come in from? Presumably a couple of spots, because they'll be pushing this. 
Uh, throw this out, come on, come on, come on. Walk right into it, buddy. Nope. You just, if you try to guess where they're going to be, it doesn't work. But also, if you try to just aim right at them, that also doesn't work. You just gotta be closer, which is so tough to do with this specific situation. But even, something that I've definitely observed is throwing the funky bouncer on an oak with acorns, even if it doesn't budge them, it still counts. So that's nice. Oh, damaged you a little bit. I know there was a nightcap over this way. Can we get her? Did that count? I don't think that got her. Oh well. Oh, hello. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Yeah, I got somebody. That's nice, that's real nice. And we got a Revenge for the Grave. Character challenge completed. Which one was that? That was probably the experience one if I had to guess, so. Yeah, we're up two challenges. We got a couple more to go. We're getting pretty close to some of them. The one that's really taking me a while is both stun your foes with Boogie Bolt, which we're almost halfway through, and then deal the disco, the damage with the Disco Tornado. And that one's only taking a while because I'm just not very good at it. I don't think it's because it's a particularly difficult challenge. And like I said, that is definitely an easy one where you could go into story mode, run up to a group of plants, and then just do it over and over again. Um, oh, you are so little health. No, you don't. No, you don't. Where do you think you're going? Hold on now. There we go. That got you. And there's more people over here. We sort of damaged them a little bit, which is nice. Oh, I got you a little bit more too. A lot of them are trying to go over this way. Cause a lot of problems for us. But while that's happening, they have teammates on the other side making things work for them. There was a sunflower over here. Can't quite get her. Oh well. Okay, ready for this? I got gotcha. you. All right, we're at 49 out of 50. I just need one more. In the meantime, throwing this out, because this guy is not even paying attention. So if we could just get him. Yes, okay. At least a little bit. That's it, stack that damage up. Excellent stuff. Okay, so over this way, ready? Gotcha, there it is, character challenge completed. Okay, be careful, ouch. That was not very careful, <laughs> but hey, I tried. So that's three challenges completed. So I was right, you know, we're more than halfway through now. And I think for now we'll just, of course, try to land that primary weapon damage, definitely on the oaks, because usually there's some acorns next to him and then that'll do some stunning because of that. And that's always really nice. Yeah, like right here. He's just such a big target too. So that's earning up stuns as you can see, which is really, really important. And he's just such a big target, it's easier to consistently do that than anything else. Okay, who's down here making this so difficult for me? There we go, uh, I didn't even get to activate it. Oh, that's lame. I was hoping that I would be able to. Maybe it'll activate itself at some point. No, it, it fizzled out. Oh well. But hey, we've made some good progress. I do need to track the next one, um, whatever I wanna do. Oh, I pressed all the wrong buttons. <laughs> uh, we'll do this one. The boogie bolt's gonna do what the boogie bolt does. I can't really control it anyway, so let's just focus on this one. So halfway to that would be what? 1750. So let's just try to at least get to halfway in this round. If we can do that, I'd be pretty happy with it. And then I think we'll do one more round after this. I forgot to customize electric slide. I told you I was gonna forget, did I? Maybe I forgot to tell you that I was gonna forget. Anyways, whoop, dup, dup, ah, leave me alone. I'm at three health, but I can survive. I know I can, maybe, uh, it's questionable. Oh, I got a vanquish. Oh, that's cool, that got me a little bit of uh, extra health back. What do we got over it this way? Um, at least a sunflower, at the least. Come on, come on. I don't know why the acorn decided to pick it up. <laughs> He's trying to make me look bad from last episode where I you know, was saying it's probably not a good idea to pick it up with the acorn. That was uh, last episode when I was playing the acorn overlord. Okay, you guys gotta get back, okay? I can't have you grabbing that, wow. They took out both of us there with a uh, shell shot. Okay, I thought it was something more explosive. It looks like it to me. But that definitely helped me get at least a little bit more damage out. I think it would have gone a little bit better. They got three batteries in that time? What were we doing? Oh no, you don't, you get back here. Come on, that didn't do any stuns. It is sort of very pick and choosy about that. Okay, throw you backwards so I don't have to deal with you. No, I still got stunned. Of course I did. All right, buddy. All right. Never mind. Thought that was gonna work out much better than it ended up doing. 
Oh, get you at least a little bit. Ow! Oh, was that the Citron again? No, it was the Oak with the Super Sap Trap. The Acorns and the Oaks have not been teaming up as much. They've sort of been going on their own, so because of that, I don't think they've you know given me the opportunity really to get too many stun attacks on them. Let's just keep moving. We're getting there, but at the same time, they're winning pretty quick. They have two more batteries now. Like, they're going really fast as it is. Okay, well, that nightcap is gone. Oh, she's coming for me, too. Then I will be leaving now. Goodbye. Oh, here we go, here we go, here we go. Gotcha. At least a little bit, please. <laughs> oh, man. This has not been the best situation for me. But overall, I mean, I'm glad that we're getting the challenges done that we are. We have earned up three three challenges, that's uh, six prize bulbs, so we're up to eight now. And we're getting pretty close to our next just experience prize bulb, so we should be able to spend it on at least one thing. Actually, very fittingly, I'm respawning now because I need to customize the electric slide. But um, there is a new taunt for the electric slide that we should be getting. And oh, that the round's over. <laughs> I'm really good at timing that at an awful time. Next round, the first thing I gotta do is change the costume. But hey, it looks like the plants won this one. This is gonna fall over, right? Yeah, there it goes. They played a good round, for sure. See, I'm doing it, I'm doing it. Uh, what do we wanna get here? Oh, definitely this hat, for sure. I like that one. Uh, down this way, let's do this. And, oh, this. Oh, that looks so good with that, with that hat. I like that. Um, and these glasses. Looking pretty cool. All right, much better. So we have 20 seconds before the game begins. Let's also then take a quick look, I know. Um, at our character upgrades. So we have low life, we have chain lightning, arc and electricity from Boogie Bolt jumps to an additional nearby target. That's good, we wanna keep that one, I think. And then a vampiric. I think that we could maybe change things around at some point. Okay, inflict electrical stun faster. Ooh, we want that actually. How many points is that? That is four. So I'd have to get rid of this one and that one and then go back down here and do that. Excellent. So let's get into the action now. Defend pump station. Uh, we're getting closer to level 10. Definitely not something we'll be getting in today's episode because this will probably be the last round of the day. But we will try to help Zomboss defend his drill as well as possible. So what's going on around here? Well, first off, I see you. Couldn't do much about you, apparently. Oh, yeah, let's beat this this thing up. See, it really only does the stun when things are chained up, because when I'm attacking an opponent one-on-one, -on -one, I never get the stun experience. Oh, so let's do this. Some extra damage, for sure. It's not a ton, but it's definitely a lot more than what I'm normally doing. There we go, gotcha. Once again, there weren't really too many other plants around, though. So we're just gonna have to wait and see if that opportunity arises and we're able to hit multiple targets. Let's get you. He's trying to get away. I feel bad. There he goes. Okay, who is it now? There's a cactus. We can get the cactus maybe. Where'd the cactus go? No, oh, oh, oh. Okay, that wasn't worth doing. <laughs> she was at like one health. But I destroyed the potato mines. Like I said, I just wanna get the halfway. Gotcha. Oh, definitely work on the um, oak a little bit. He's a big target. We got a couple of stuns. There's a little bit more. More stuns. Excellent. And a times three vanquish streak. I can't believe it. Oh, here you are. Uh, oh, I don't even have the storm. I was trying to throw the storm out there. <laughs> Didn't quite work. So let's back it up a little bit. They can't get clustered up if they're not even trying to get this point right now. Oh, hello. Gotcha. Yeah, couldn't make the jump. Oh well. So I think we're on the team that sort of, for the most part, won last round. Well, let's revive Super Brains here. We can help out with that a little bit, can't we? I feel so bad because these guys are just trying to get out of their spawn. But this seems to happen a lot on this point specifically. Let's revive you. Oh, the, the engineer's trying to come in to help too. Okay, I still got it though. Still got it. Oh, somebody's actually taking the point right now. Who's doing that? It might just be a spawnable or something. No, it's not, it's a secret nightcap. Well, sort of a little bit of both. Okay, that's something. <laughs> oh my. 
Okay, who's over here? Gotcha, that was good. We got a prize bulbal meter for that. So just experience. Very nice to see it. And somebody's over there. I don't know if they're gonna be able to make it past this first point, but we'll certainly see what's going on. Okay, quickly change like that, and then try to stack up that stun damage. Now's our chance, and then go in there with that. Activate the cloud. Okay, this is what I'm talking about. We needed more of this. Got a stun there. Where do you think you're going? Come on, just a couple more hits on you. Should do the trick. There it is. Who is over this way? Let's get them all bunched up again if I can. Is that working? I did get at least one more stun. Come on now. Gotta get as many as possible. Throw in the cloud. Uh, the storm, you know. And that's doing something. It's almost at halfway. Remember, 1,750 would be halfway. Okay. We're doing pretty good because they're not noticing us. <laughs> there we go. That's gonna get us some stuns. They are just flying away. Wow! Somebody just got a vanquish explosion there. You're welcome. That was pretty cool. Okay, somebody on the point yet? Yep, there is this nightcap right there. Throw out that damage from that. You're sort of trapped against the corner. 17-10, we can do it, we can do it. See, this round's much better. Okay, who is it? Who is it? It's somebody on the roof. Gotta be careful of that. I'll try to get up there, see if we can't get too much done. Is a Colonel Corn still up here causing problems? You bet he is. Oh no, he's gonna try to do that to me. Oh, hit the pipe. Bad luck there. I'm so sorry. Okay, somebody got you. I'm at a times 12 vanquish streak? That's unheard of for me, at least. Come on, throw that back over there. Why didn't that work? Why did, why did that go right through you? Come on, gotcha. Very fortunate though. Working out really, really well. Level eight achieved. Okay. Get over this way. Oh, hello. I just, I feel bad for the plant team right now. I just went, they're getting really beat up. I know what that feels like, because that was us last round. Oh. Okay, be careful. Activate the cloud. It didn't do much that time. Gotcha. Uh, I don't know why. I just panicked and threw that. It didn't do anything for me. That was amazing, though. 13 or 14 vanquished. You're worth the 16 in total, which is just totally insane. And they only have 28 seconds left to get this. I don't think we got any extra challenges done, but we definitely made a lot of progress so far. I wouldn't mind if they made a comeback here and took it so that we can just keep going with these guys because it's going great. Okay, so 12 seconds remaining. Maybe they could push in overtime. I'm not sure. Okay, gotta be careful. He's probably gonna try to husk cop over me. And I can't have that happen too much. There we go. And there we go, we gotta win. All right, well that was a pretty quick round, but overall I had a lot of fun with it. And how are we doing with the challenges? I might check real quick to consider whether I wanna do another round or not. We'll find out. If I'm like really close, I'll probably do one more round. But if not, then I might just leave it for my own time. I know I'm not too close with the electric slide uh, or the electric storm, so I'm really not sure. But we're about to find out. After our totals up, we should have gotten top vanquisher though. Let's see. Uh, yep, top vanquisher with a whopping 17 vanquishes, very nice. So like I said, we'll see what we got here in terms of coins as well. Been earning up more coins, of course, episode 100, we did a three million spending spree. Now I gotta earn up four million. Uh, let's see, uh, not too close. So I think we'll finish it up with that. So there was a look at the electric slide challenges for Feast of Us. As you can see, we've got three out of five of them done. And these two are just sort of a rinse and repeat thing. Just keep playing electric slide, you'll earn it up in no time, sooner or later. Definitely do story mode if you want to, uh, probably be easier. But yeah, we have nine bulbs in total, which will get us one prize in almost the next one. But at least for right now, we get the very fitting pan stance for the electric slide. We'll go ahead and unlock that and take a look at it real fast. But yeah, definitely I enjoyed our start to the challenges and we'll try to get more along the way completed. But uh, next episode, we're actually doing the new weekly events. We'll probably play more Oxic Slide there and get it done that way. But for right now, look at her boogie down.
Very cool. So with that being said, that is gonna wrap it up for today's episode of Plants vs. Zombies Battle for Neighborville. Before you go, be sure to comment Zebra Slide so now you've watched at the end of the you are a Zebratastic viewer. Also, subscribe to join the Zebra Herd. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.